We're learning tonight a student at Belmont University who was hit by a stray bullet walking near campus has died. 18 year old Jillian Ludwig was walking on a track in a Nashville park when she was shot Tuesday. Yesterday, her fellow students at Belmont held a vigil as she lay in critical condition after being shot in the head. She died this morning. The suspect, Shaquille Taylor, is now in custody. Back in May, a prosecutor dropped earlier charges against him in a different case. Doctors testified he wasn't competent to stand trial, but they say he didn't meet the standard or threshold for involuntary commitment to a care center, so he was released from jail. We spoke to House Speaker Cameron Sexton this afternoon, who says this shows a failure within the system. The problem is, is right now, even with this individual, Think about this. He committed another heinous crime. There's a victim, and now this victim is dead. And if the court declares him incompetent, guess what happens again? It gets dismissed. And that's just wrong. We did ask the speaker if a red flag, flag law might have prevented this shooting. Again, those laws don't allow people with certain medical conditions to have a gun. He said no. We don't know how that suspect got the gun. And the speaker says red flag laws might have prevented shootings, but not this one. He says the suspect should have been involuntarily committed and that he would have never been allowed to have a gun had that happened.